We are expecting to see the potential for some showers today. It looks to be middle of the day, um, but about a 30, 20 to 30 percent chance of that happening. Uh, variable clouds. We're going to see our high today is going to be 72 degrees, about four or five o'clock. Otherwise, uh, really just variable clouds today. It's going to be a cooler day. Yesterday we were at 80 degrees, so not too bad. Um, satellite and radar, what I'm doing is showing you where the energy is, which is down into Pocatello and wrapping up towards the southeast corner or southwest corner of Montana. That is that potential shower activity we're going to see come over us later on today. So we're going to have some uh, scattered showers out of that. We'll see what the mountains pull uh, from it, but yeah, there's pretty good opportunity. So future radar. We look at this starting to build in, come in, and by noon, we have a higher increased chance of seeing those showers. They're going to be spotty, hit and miss, um, really peeling north and then being pulled east. So by tomorrow morning at 1.30, 2 o'clock in the morning, still some scattered, isolated showers. And then it clears out. We start to see sort of a warmer band or a cleaner band of air coming in for Wednesday evening and we dry out with sunshine expected on Thursday. Aurora Borealis, we have the chance of seeing some northern lights. The issue is going to be the cloud cover, of course, but uh, we're in a, a pretty good frame there. You can see above the red line, the view line, that encompasses most of Washington, uh, North Idaho, and then most of Montana. So for those people in those areas, you get a break in the clouds, you might be able to see that. Our planning forecast is all about uh, temperatures into the low to mid 70s this week and around 70 for Saturday and Sunday. Again, potential northern lights tonight. I'm Mark Peterson, 4 News Now in the First Alert Weather Center. Have a great day.